I am in a Waymo and my cruise is right there. Oh, it's gone. Crap. Okay. Well, we're meeting at the same spot. So yeah, there it is. I'm taking a Waymo from the airport to get a cruise. And then from the cruise, I'm, I don't know. I'm doing all kinds of AV shenanigans tonight. Waymo cruise double action. Let's go. <laughs> oh, this is great. I love this. Hey, welcome back to cruise. Welcome back to cruise. Uh, let's go. Let's cruise. For safety, we're recording video, but no audio. So here's what our route looks like tonight. Uh, we're starting up near Tempe area. We're going all the way down to Chandler. So have a good time. Woo! Wow. Right off, right off the bat. Um, a few things to remember. Oh, for mind. heaven's sake. Please keep your seatbelt buckled. Holy crap. Always keep your hands and arms inside. This thing is aggressive. For crew support, press the square button on the ceiling above you. Is it to square? To early, press the larger round button on the ceiling and we'll pull over. Yeah, I guess it is a square. Enjoy your ride. Bye bye, Waymo. <laughs> What a world we live in. See if I can get it to focus. Okay, I'll try and hold my camera still for once. Um, yeah, cool. Okay, finally, we have the radio. That's nice. Uh, I would put my GoPro in here, which I do have in my bag. However, it's basically useless and low light, so forget it. But, uh... Nice. We... We got over in the lanes real quick and that unprotected right was kind of insane uh, there's another cruise empty cruise okay I'm we're going are we capped at 37 miles an hour is that what this is I don't know Apparently the coldest temperature allowed in this car is 65, whereas in Waymo it's 59. Okay. So far so good. Say, driver or not. Is that a Waymo rider support van? I don't know. I never know. You can never can tell with the Dodge Caravans nowadays. Uh, anyway, yeah, this is uh, this is great. A ooh, little bit of heavy brake in there. Not quite as smooth. Another cruise coming up on the side. That is Diamond. I'm in the cruise AV. This thing will not focus. Come on, there you go. Yeah, I mean, if you go 35 and a 45, not many people are gonna like you, but yeah. <laughs> You know, I could try the GoPro. I wonder. There goes the Waymo. So I got somebody that the median right there. Ooh, that's a close, but don't touch. Very close. It's just surreal. It's wandering. We're wandering around at night, and there's just robots on the streets. Like, this is ridiculous.
Wow. Your tires suck. <laughs> or something like that. I mean, yeah, so far the cruise fee is only a flat $5, which in order to get from the airport to the cruise service area, the Waymo ride was $34. So, uh... Yeesh. Although, I don't have to worry about that. Very thankfully, because, again, this series is sponsored by Ray Labs. They are sweet. Once again, thank you to them uh, for this trip. It is awesome. Yeah, so, yeah, the, the lane changes are noticeably aggressive. Um, and of note is that the blinker speaker is disabled. Um, so, you know, it, it kind of just feels like it's a bad driver, but you can see the, um, the indicator on the dash if you're looking. So, yeah. But uh yeah. I don't think we've gone above thirty seven. Right now we're going thirty two and a forty five. Uh I mean now that it's you know after nine PM when the service opens it doesn't really matter, honestly. Um but it's main roads. That's a big step. That is a big step. So, yeah, the only wackiness here, really, on the route... It is pretty straightforward, but we do appear to be taking a couple of detours for some... Let's see... There's one, uh, come, yeah, coming up here is, we would have turned left here, but instead we're going to do a little three rights to make a left detour. Um, that's fine, I guess. Yeah, the timing was amazing. I like I stepped off the plane from San Francisco. I was walking through the terminal. I hailed a Waymo. Took the Waymo from there to here. Uh, cruise pickup spot. It's like I've just been doing AVs all day. It is a great day. See how it takes this turn. So naturally, yeah. I I love to see the improvements here. Love it. They have made huge strides in the last year. Yeah, you can you can see the blinker on the, yeah. I do love that the speedometer is big enough to see on video um you know whatever the wheel's not covering it up uh for luke the range in this car is 154 miles which is a lot more than waymo can say for itself over the last day or two holy cow
Right turn, unprotected right. Let's take a look at the traffic. We're just gonna go for it. Right there, yep. Doesn't even care. What a Chad. I, I almost feel, oh, 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 just kidding. 41, 41 miles an hour. Are we gonna take it? No. Quick stop. Oh, ooh, we overshot a little bit. We're in the crosswalk, but okay. But yeah, I almost want to say that Cruz is, why are we still, no, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, I thought it was going to go through the red. No, 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 no. It's still, I don't, what I was saying is I almost want to say that Waymo's turns are better. Or no, sorry, Cruz's turns are better than Waymo's in some respects. Um, oh my gosh, why are we inching forward at a red light like this? What? It's making me think it has an itchy trigger finger. Like this thing is, I almost feel like it would sprint through the red light if it had the chance. I, okay, no, okay, all right. <laughs> like that was making me nervous. <laughs> like, uh, uh. Yeah, don't be, don't be running red lights. I mean, I was scrolling Twitter tonight and a YouTuber I really like, Real Engineering, Brian McManus, I think he's based in Austin, Texas. And he doesn't have a very good impression of AVs right now because uh, Cruz's operations. And he's complaining that he's seen them run red lights and blah, 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 blah. Um, oh, gracious. Yeah, the... Uh, I don't know. I see people's point of view, public sentiment. I mean, actually, don't really, honestly. AVs are so cool. I can't possibly understand why people don't like them, but whatever. I try to, at least. Um you know, but he's, I guess he's anti-AV now, I don't know, <sighs> 41 miles an hour, uh, I think that's the highest I've seen. It feels weird to go this fast in a cruise. Right through the yellow. I still almost feel like I could slam on the brakes at any second, but uh, I don't know. through a neighborhood here. We're going to turn right, go through a little bit of a neighborhood, and then turn right out onto another road instead of just turning right at a normal intersection. Um, I almost get the feeling that we're avoiding turns at big intersections because the perception isn't good enough, or like the range of it. Uh, that's kind of a shot in the dark from me there, but... I feel like Waymo's side cameras tend seem like they're doing a lot for him. I mean, you know, of course I can't confirm, but uh, oh, there's another cruise. Didn't catch the name. They are roaming tonight. Start slowing down. Oh yeah, there you go. Ooh. I will, although Cruz's turns are quite good, uh, slowing for stoplight is kind of a rickety process here. Um, but it's, it doesn't really affect anything, I guess. I'm not going to complain about it. of note is that there was a little section of Tempe 
that was available. Hi. <laughs> uh, for hailing. And, yeah, there's people looking at us, smiling. Uh, that has been cut off now. So, the service area has shrank in Phoenix. Shrunk? Shrank. Uh, so, it used to go almost all the way to the airport. Um, and I think they're, they're probably having issues with that area. I don't know. There is an excellent video uh, by... Brian Wilt out there on YouTube. If you want to check it out. Cruz's first opening days in Phoenix. I will probably put an info card here if I can remember to do it. But yeah, so he gets all kinds of interesting stuff. Um, and that video didn't get much attention. So if that sounds interesting to you, yeah. But. Yeah, I couldn't do it because I was still in Idaho. So, yeah, I'm just here for here for today, yesterday, and today, essentially. But seven miles an hour over the speed bump. Since the last time I rode, even before that, it, yeah, I continue to see improvements. Unfortunately, I didn't catch Cruz in in San Francisco tonight because, yeah, I I had to go <laughs> get back to Phoenix so I can get back to Idaho tomorrow. But yeah, sometime or another, maybe maybe next year. Going around the turn. Ooh, yeah. I had a bit, of, a bit of a snaking job to do there. Yeah. Made it work. Okay, there's a cat in the middle of the road. We are nudging around the cat, and the cat ran out of the road when it saw us coming. So, cool. Very cool. Uh, one time, it's not likely mo many of you are watching 18 minutes into this video. Uh, one time I actually set up a cardboard box for Waymo to run over, and it actually did run over it. Uh, that was Pacifica Age. Uh, I didn't publish that, because I, like, did a silly thing and, um, faked, faked it. Like, we set up a cardboard box in the middle of the road at a destination, and then hailed from far away and then at the end of the ride there just happened to be a box there but my act my acting was like bad <laughs> so even if I did want to publish that I don't know where the footage is so whatever um uh, okay I thought those were Christmas decorations for a second I was gonna be like, hold your horses, guys. Not yet. Like, come on. I mean, by the time you're seeing this, it could be almost Christmas. Who knows how long it's gonna take me to edit all of this. Uh. <laughs> oh, dear. And I also have some other work to do before I start publishing this series here, so. Ooh, better get that done. Okay, we're coming up on the end of our extended detour. Finally. I still like how the wheel icon on the screen matches the real thing. 
that is quite neat attention to detail. I need to call a lift to get home, but uh, I am filming on my phone. So I am SOL, essentially. Hmm, how close can I get to home now? Not very close. Oh, oh, well I could Waymo farther down. Uh, going by the wait times recently, it's uh, not a good outlook. I could be home as late as eleven. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna give up and lift. <laughs> Back on the open road at forty one miles an hour, and no higher. Absolutely not. Welcome to Chandler. Were we in Mesa? Was that Tempe or was that Gilbert? I don't know. But anyway, there was a sign that said, Welcome to Chandler. So, yeah. I... S yeah. The fact that Cruise covers multiple cities now, at least partially, I think... Uh, I think they can kind of get away with saying Phoenix. If it was just Chandler, then I'd be more, you know, inclined to uh, not do that. But, uh... Another cruise. And another Waymo. Yeah, SF, you ain't got nothing on us. <laughs> Fifty-five on these roads sometimes. So zoom indeed. Honestly, yeah, I have almost nothing but positive things to say. As much as Cruz continues to ignore my Twitter DMs, and their support is not very helpful. The product is good. Gotta say it. I mean, at least here. I know there's been issues in SF, but hey. Yeah. Sweetie's Candy out on the right. That's where we did one of uh, one of the Waymo videos way back. I think I mentioned that. Yeah, a few videos ago. I would like to know the rationale behind why sometimes we go 37 and sometimes we go 41. Uh, I want to say we almost do appear to be playing a slow game of Pong and with the lane lines here, but it's pretty subtle. Uh, okay, that was less subtle. Really, I wish I could put G-force indicators on the screen so you could see it. 
but yeah, okay, yeah, now we're, now it's a little bit more intense. Um. We do tend to slow down a lot later than Waymo would for, uh, stoplights and other traffic ahead. Does that really affect anything? Eh. Eh. Go Ray Road. Now the speed limit is forty. There, <laughs> okay. And we just changed lane. The, the lane changes are so aggressive. Uh, uh, yeah, anyway, the speed limit is now 40, so we could theoretically hit that maximum. Uh, well, the other traffic does seem to be a little bit slower than that. So we are kind of matching it. We are coming up on the end here. Any second it'll play the... Remember to take your stuff. Um, at some point. I think we basically crossed the whole service area. Oh, there's another rainbow. I couldn't... Yeah. Uh, We're arriving soon. Please stay buckled up until we stop and grab all your things. Yeah, I couldn't actually see the boundaries of the cruise service area because the app is glitched. Uh, if that Waymo is hailable, I might actually have a quick ride out of here, but we'll see. So. Now that I have failed to hail any cars in advance, I will have to stand here and figure myself out. So, yeah. We've arrived. Check for bikes and cars as you exit on the sidewalk side. Thanks for riding with Cruz. That was an inter interesting sound design there. Uh, okay. Thank you for joining me on yet another AV ride, which I've done so many of today. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Oh, shoot.